morning, Charlie. You want to tell everybody? Good morning. Good morning. Say, Mom, I want up there with you. Yep. Hi, it's Lori. And well, today we're going to pick up the camera and do a day in the life. And there are some things that's changed in our life in the last uh, week. Um, we haven't really done any videos for a while, but one of those changes is we have a puppy now and she's running around here somewhere. I'll catch her in just a second. Her name is Charlie. Uh, you might have seen her here in the front of the video here when we did a little, small little introduction. But she's here. She's changed her life. Oh, look at the backwash. Backlight, I mean. And it's been a lot of fun. So let's go find Charlie and take a look at her. Charlie, you want to say hi to our friends on YouTube? Do you want to say hi to our friends on YouTube? Come over here where we got some better light. That's it. Come on. That's a girl. This is Charlie Rose, and she is a girl. And um, she is a full bred, uh, is that what I say? Full bred? She's a full bred shit zoo. Uh, first dog Eric and I have ever owned, and I haven't had a dog since I was a kid. And there's Audrey to share <laughs> Charlie with you. But uh, yeah, we are excited to have her as part of our life, and we're excited to bring you some videos of Charlie growing up right now. She is um, just about 15 weeks old, so she's not quite four months, and we are in the process of getting her potty trained. One of the techniques we are using to help train Charlie to a potty, um, we are house training her to potty in the house. I have a special mat, and I'll show you that later. But one of the things I use as a training tool are strawberries. We had some doggy treats, and Charlie didn't seem to like them, but she seems to really, really love strawberries. And one of the ways, the best ways to give her strawberries is to uh, dehydrate them or dry them. So that's what I'm doing now. I'm going to cut these strawberries up, and then I put them in my dehydrator here. And um, I set that for, for strawberries. I set that for 135, and I slice them thin enough that they are probably done in about six hours. And here is a look at all the strawberries. I'm just going to um, stack them up here. Sorry for the unsteady camera. I'm trying to do a few things at once. I have a Doogie running by and a Charlie running by. So stack them up and then I put this lid on top, get it secure. Let me see here. Okay, it's securely in place. And then we are going to plug in and it just automatically starts when you plug in. So like I said, set this on 135 and we'll check this after six hours and see how well everything is looking. Got a little strawberry juice on the outside, but that's okay. Okay, well, we momentarily lost power here. Not very long, like literally long enough to reset all the clocks. But unfortunately, when it went down, the UPS that my firewall, which our internet goes through, which is hooked up to, uh, the UPS is dead. So it also took down my firewall for the internet. And you hear the kids over here arguing. Anyways, when it took down that firewall, when the firewall came back up, the internet's not working. I'm not an IT guru in the sense that Eric only knows what that's all about. And so we have no internet in the house until he gets home. So um, we're going to take this opportunity to uh, go do some grocery shopping. And this will be the first time that Charlie will have been left home here alone. Um, keeping my fingers crossed for the best. But I'm going to keep her in her pen in here in the mudroom. Uh, with her water and where she potties so hopefully everything goes okay all right so we're here at trader joe's um it is so windy today we have wind gusts up to 55 miles per hour don't we it's my channel this it's is colin's channel no, it's is very happy to see us home. <laughs> She's so happy to see us home. Hey, Charlie. Hi. She's like running around like, oh, what's say? What you buy, Mom? What you buy? Nothing for you today, Charlie. Don't eat it. Don't eat it. Yeah. Don't want to eat that. <laughs> okay, so we're home from running, and um, I did make... 
a haul video. Whew, my brain's not working very clear today. Made a haul video of the food we bought from Trader Joe's. Whew, can't think. And then I picked up lunch. So I'll show you real quick what I got for lunch. I got chicken fries, ranch, and it's barbecue. And I got a plain hamburger. Plain and these chicken fries, which are something we've never, we haven't went to Burger King in a long time, and chicken fries are definitely um, something we didn't know about. You know, I'm gonna try, I'm gonna try fried fries instead of barbecue. What'd you get, Maddie? Yeah, it's a burger and fried fries and a hot. Yeah, and what about you, Colin? And the reason I went to Burger King, and we haven't went to Burger King in years, was because I seen when I drove by, they had hot dogs on the menu. And Colin will not eat chicken nuggets and will not eat hamburgers. But you will eat... Hot dog. A hot dog. I got some kind of chicken sandwich. I don't remember the name of it. But there's mine. So I'm going to sit down and enjoy my lunch. All berries are done. <laughs> you see how much they shrink up here. So, um, these are done. These are great. This is healthy for my dog and even the kids when they stand in there, they'll eat one. And, um, yeah, it tastes like a fruit snack, essentially. Really good. So, strawberries are done. Got something accomplished today. Charlie's treats made I need to finish making her dog food for the week and last night I cooked the um, get that in the fridge cooked the chicken and the eggs and the rice and today I just need to process them so really quickly here I will uh, show you what we have so if you look in here You'll see there's chicken, eggs, and rice. Basically, I'm just going to put this in my food processor, process this, up, process this up, and this will be her dog food for this week. Tonight's dinner, butternut squash, braised kale sauce, and a French baguette. Okay, so we're going to go ahead and call it a day here. Uh, Charlie has definitely uh, called it a day. She's been out now for the last 30 minutes here on the couch trying not to really let her on the couch, but uh, the kids were kind of aggravating her. So when the kids went off to bed, I let her climb up there. And um, before I go to bed, I'm going to enjoy that bowl of ice cream. So I will talk to everybody later. Bye.